Hey there, RecTech family, I'm Chef Greg, and this is the easiest smoked turkey breast recipe for the holidays. My family's not a big fan of the dark meat, so we cook a couple of these split turkey breasts, and that way everybody gets what they want, and I maximize the space to the grill. Speaking of grills, we got the RecTech 410 Patio Legend behind me, burning those ultimate blend pellets, uh, 325 degrees, smells amazing. We've got a right about an eight pound turkey breast here, okay, and what you wanna do is kinda get in there and loosen up the skin. Now this one was kind of like a little little janky out the, out the box. We were missing some skin here, so um, it is what it is. You make the best of it, right? So you wanna kinda pull that skin back so you can expose some of that, that turkey meat. And we've got some chopped sage, rosemary, and thyme. And we're just gonna kinda give it like an herb crust underneath the skin here, okay? We're also gonna take some of that Colden's Freaky, Colden's Freaking Greek because it is the holidays. Okay, and we're gonna season that up as well. And then we'll pull the skin back over the top and season the top, and that skin's gonna give us good moisture and flavor to that bird, right? Now again, this turkey doesn't have a ton of skin, but it's the heart healthy version, right? So do the best you can. You can spray this with olive oil if you want. If you really want to elevate your game, you could put some butter underneath, but again, to each their own. Take some of that coldness freaking Greek over the top, don't forget the inside, okay? Season everywhere. Because when we're done eating that turkey, we're gonna save this breastplate and we're gonna make some amazing turkey soup, right? Perfect. All right, like I said, we've got the Rectech Patio Legend fired up to 325 degrees. And again, this is one of the smaller grills in our lineup, but you don't give up any space. Again, plenty of head space in this grill. I could easily fit four of these turkey breasts in here. About 75 to 90 minutes later, you'll be 165 internal. That right there is perfectly roasted turkey breast. Now, if that doesn't look like a perfectly roasted turkey breast, I don't know what does. Super simple, 325 degrees, about 75 minutes, some fresh herbs, some of that Colden's freaking Greek. All that's next is the gravy. We'll see you at the Rectech.